day internet people uh, this has finally arrived it took ages to turn up but it's here now it's the overlord blaze toshiki kai or if you don't know how to say it toshiki k if you want to say that probably not because that's completely wrong um yeah it's the legend deck the second legend deck this one is kagero and it is all brand new cards for this set, I believe, which is pretty cool. This took ages to arrive, um, and I will also throw in the disclaimer that the entire Draw the Trigger team is currently Lurgified. We've been hit by Papa Nurgle, and we've all got colds and stuff. So I will sound a little bit dead for the duration of this video. Um, and this isn't my deck either, this is Lena's, so... But she's gone to work, because it's a Saturday and she has to work. So, yeah. So what do we get? Let's have a look. Uh, is there sellotape on this as well? Oh, sellotape. Where's Blaster Blade? So this is a bit of a, uh, yeah, an unwell unboxing. But we couldn't really wait any longer to bring this to you, because it's been too long already. So, let's have a look. First up, you've got a deck box. Shall we see what this looks like? How the heck do you get into it? It's up there. Uh, So, yeah, click, click like to wish us uh, to get better soon because it's not fun being half dead. Um, yeah, so that's the uh, deck box all laid flat. Pretty cool. It's reasonably big. It's I think it's bigger than the one that came with the other deck, the Shadow Paladin one, which was notoriously tiny. But I think this is the kind of... It's not as big as the new Japanese ones, which are designed to hold 16 G units, because that would require the English Bushy Road to kind of plan ahead for stuff like that, but I don't know how much information they seem to have on the English division before things happen, so they obviously didn't make this one of the larger sized ones. Uh, let's just tuck this into there, and tuck this into there. Wow, you've even had a little tutorial on how not to make these boxes because I am clumsy and useless. So, there we go, there we go. And that bit tucks into there. So, yeah, there's your little deck box. And it took me about two minutes just to build that because I'm absolutely useless. And there you go. So, that's that. Next up, we get the little bag of goodies, um, in, of which there's a... A fighter's counter with 10,000 on that side and 5,000 on that side. That's pretty cool. You've got a Kagero clan card with Mr. Kai on that side. Not a unit, just the uh, Mr. Kai. So that's pretty cool. And then there's two promo cards here as well. What, what are these? Let's have a look. Ah, they're both this guy. So it's Dragonic Overlord the Ace. And I, are they both non hollow? They are both non hollow. So this guy, I think he was in one of the fighters collections, so that's pretty cool that you get two of those. They're non hollow, so they're a little bit boring to look at, but that's pretty cool. I'm not going to read the skill because it's long ass, but if you want to read it, you can pause that and have a look. Um, I don't actually know what it does, I haven't bothered to read it. So there's that, there's the Tochiki Kai uh, playmat thing. Uh, that won't fit on the camera, but I'm sure you can find a picture of that on the internet somewhere. And a little status guide like you always get. And then, the stuff that you really want to see. Uh, the deck split over two little mini piles. So let's have a look at this little mini pile first. So I'm going to zoom in a bit. There we go, that's a bit too much. Okay, so you've got Dragonic Overlord the Legend. He's your main grade 3 for your deck. Uh, he's got two skills, he's got a GB2 skill and an auto skill and again my eyes are just absolutely knackered right now so I can't actually read that out so get one two three four of him and then you've got amber dragon midnight another grade three 11k uh, quite a simple skill it's just cat blast one but it's placed to choose from the opponent's grade one unless rear guards and retire it so that's pretty cool one two three four of those you've got emperor dragon knight Nahalem. So he's a pretty cool one. He used to be the 10k, didn't Mr. Nahalem, I believe. Uh, and now he's got that. Like I said, if you want to read the skills, 
please just pause it because I've got such a headache. I can't literally read stuff out properly right now. So there's one, two, three, a full place at the Harlem. That's pretty cool. Then you've got Spear of the Flame Dragon Tar. This is 7k with a skill. One, two, three, and four. Flame of Tranquility Ermo is your perfect guard. He's the same as the Witch perfect guard from the Legend deck before the Shadow Palatine one. So it's basically a drop and draw skill. So obviously you've got your full playset of the perfect guard. Ah, some triggers. So you got a Vanilla Crit. And a nice heal. That's quite pretty. And that's the first half of the deck. And then you've got this half, which has got your stride units. So we start off with this stride here, which is Transcendence, Divine, Dragon, Nouvelle, Vague, Express. Because they just had to make that as long as they could, right? So, yeah, pause that to see what that does. That's pretty cool. Uh, the artwork's pretty neat. I like that. So you've got one, two, three, four of those. Then you've got Supreme Heavenly Emperor Dragon Vortex Desire. So he's pretty cool. So you get one, two of those. So including the promos, you actually get eight stride units in this set, which is pretty crazy. Okay, so then you've got Grade 2, Armor of the Flame Dragon Bar. So Bar's been upgraded um, another grade. So you get one, two, three of those. Then you've got Berserk Lord Dragon. So this is an upgraded Berserk Dragon. Um, and you get one, two, three, four of those. Dragon partner Monica, she used to be the draw trigger. Now she's a 7k that basically gets plus three when it boosts a Flame Dragon. That's pretty neat. One, two of those. Lizard General Conro. Conro's back as a grade one. You get one, two, three, and four. And your starter is Lizard Hero Under. So Under is back, and this time he's actually got a skill. Um, so it basically, yeah, searches out an Overlord, which is pretty useful. And then we've got some more crits, because... Oh, it's Goku. He was uh, grade 3 in the original trial deck. That's pretty nice. So you get one, two, three, four of those. And you've got a draw trigger. Ken Ren Master Gojo. And you got one, two, three, and four. Four draws. So that's your deck. Um, it's pretty cool. It's it looks like it's going to be fairly solid to play with. Um, obviously, straight out of the box, we haven't actually played with it or really particularly looked at what the cards do. But we'll see if we can get a little head-to-head -head with this against one of our other decks. Maybe my Shadow Paladin deck. But that will be when we're both feeling a little bit more up to scratch because we are literally down with the sickness right now um, and we can't really do anything so watch out for that later I hope you enjoyed this little unboxing despite the fact I kind of rushed it because yeah kind of dying a bit and yeah thanks for watching see you again soon bye internet people